Hi planner friends, this is Julia from Planner Jewels and I have um, something exciting to show you guys. Sorry, that was my phone. Um, I have, um, I'm going to participate in a one book July challenge and as y'all know I have been in my rings and in my bullet journal for the longest period of time. However, <clears throat> I thought I will just challenge myself and go back to like the planner that I used for the longest time, which was last year, I think for 10 months I almost used it. And it was a Midori standard size. It was in a, in a camel color. And my husband just recently, he went to Japan and he was in the Tokyo airport. So I, I asked him if he could find a Travelers factory um, store and he did and then he bought me this wonderful planner and I'm so excited he also bought me a new clip and some like two inserts and some washi tape so I'm like really excited I was so happy when he came home and um, had this for me um, I really like the color it's a dark brown and you might know this like there's this fly the world from Japan travelers factory airport um, it scratches up nicely which I personally very much love and what else can I tell you about the outside? Um, it's just beautiful. Um, the clip is the olive color, uh, which I love. Um, and I'm still using the Paper Made Ink Joy gel pen in the 0 0.5 um, nib size in black uh, because I like the skinnier um, nib. <laughs> so let's open it up. And this is how I have it set up. Um, I have... Uh, four inserts. Um, two of those are accessories. Uh, the first one is like going around all of the inserts, which is the zipper pocket. I have the zipper on the back and then I have some photos of my family here and I have like a little cutout from like um, a gift bag that I like the motif of. Then I have around the first insert I have the craft folder. Um, I used this one like for a long time and I kept like decorating things. I have like those adhesive pockets that you can find at the dollar spot in Target, uh, which I put some photos in on the back as well. The Tokyo Pen Shop, that's like my favorite um, Japanese stationery um, store or stationery store or online store in general. And then I have um, I have this template. What is it? It's the Sketch Master template by Stettler. And um, I just love it to use it as a ruler and sometimes like when I want to draw like a circle or a box. I have some DIY um, like labels here, some happy planner stickers that I cut down to fit here. Nothing overly special. I have a, a business card from my advisor. And I am using the weekly insert from the Travels Company. It's the dated one. Um, so you get like, when you order those at the beginning of the year, you get two books. And the first one is a lighter blue. This is a navy blue. Um, and it comes goes from January to June. And then you have this one from July to December. It's It has like the yearly overview for 2017, 2018. And then you have starting in July, you have like your, um, what is it? List like um, monthly overviews. Like, so you have two months per page and I just kept some birthdays and I need to update some more and it goes to February. And this is how I just use it. Um, it's, this, it's this layout here. So you have the week on one side and then you have a grid page on the other side here for notes or lists. And this one, as I said, is dated, so you will get like the previous and the next month. On the top here in red, you have the current month, what week you are in, and then everything is numbered. It's a Monday start, which I personally prefer. So um, I just keep it super simple. Like I have this one sticker here, uh, but other than that, I don't even use highlighter right now. Might change, I don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm just, you, you know, I put in my schedule here when we had like swim classes for my older son, when I went somewhere, I also journal a little bit in those, um, those weekly inserts. I have like, you know, when we went to the pet store to look at some, some animals with the kids, I like, um, I noted that William can swim very well, you know, just little like, you know, things that you want to remember 
uh, it's not a, a journal per se, but it's kind of, you know, just things that I want to remember and look back at. So this is what I put here. And then here you might be familiar with this when you watched like my older videos, like my first videos when I was using the Midori. I love to um, split up this side into like little categories. So I have one general category, which is this week. So um, the week before I just list down like the things that I want to accomplish this week or um, might want to look into. Then I have a to go section, to contact, to cook. Um, this was specifically for swim class, like a little packing list, so I never forget anything of those. And then a to buy section. Um, yeah, so this is quite, you know, simple, um, just pen, nothing super special. And then I just decorated here the Independence Day because I think it's kind of, you know, it's, it's nice. Sometimes you can decorate. I have like some washi stickers from the Mambi. Um, sticker collection I think then uh, here I have a little goal um, to put in because I need to go to financial aid I'm sorry that's my son <laughs> I know sweetie just wait baby just wait about the Shotzi I think it's about to be done so I want to go to financial aid and it's very important um, that I do this this week oh I'm sorry he's he just okay Alexia auf passen so I put it on a sticker so it stands out, but again, I have um, this week to go, to buy, to contact, to cook, and for now, that is it. Um, like I may, my, might add like another section if I feel like it, but it's, I keep it super simple. And I, I mark Daddy, birthdays Daddy, nowadays. Mm -hmm. Daddy? <laughs> no. Um, Alex, no. So I mark birthdays with a little star or asterisk and I put the main name down. And then, yeah, so this is, this, those are my plans for this July. And then I have like some papers here um, that I need to attend to or when I'm out and about. Then this planner came with a blank insert by the Travelers uh, Company. And this one says, have a nice trip. And it's like gold foil. It's very pretty. I love it. Uh, and I was a little bit intimidated by using a blank insert because my handwriting is all over the place when I don't have a grid or line to follow. <laughs> but um, I said, okay, just go with it. Don't beat yourself over it. Maybe being a messy. Yes. I will come in a second, okay? One second. Go get the choo-choo. Where's the choo-choo? Yeah. Go get the choo-choo. Speaking of choo-choo, um, this is the washi tape that my husband picked out at the Travelers uh, factory, which I love very much. So here I have some like important information, you know, stuff that I want to keep on hand and like some lists, um, what I need to buy like for my, my mom when my husband is going to Germany. Um, like next camping trip, like a list of things to keep in mind. My meeting with my advisor, I just added the date. I just underline every single list that I add, I just underline it, the title, so I can like look at it. Maybe I will like put in like a index somewhere, maybe to find it a little bit quicker in a number of pages, but uh, for now it's, it's enough. Like I just use this, you know, it's a little bit of a brain dump and my notes section. And then here I have a couple of um, post-it notes stuck on this zipper pouch. And inside the zipper pouch I just have a variety of like some stickers, some samplers that I got from like meetups. I cut up some, you know, the Mambi stickers. Those were from the Planner Society. Uh, some Planner Kate. You know, those, those were some Herma stickers when you're in Germany. The Herma stickers are really great to use in the planner because they are very thin. And they make labels as well, and I love them very much. You know, just a variety of stickers that I have gotten or bought over the last two years and love to use in my, my planner sometimes. So this is just what it houses here, but also, you know, like I will add some stamps in here because I always um, need stamps, especially when I'm out and about. I don't know why, but it is what it is. Um, 
Yes. So uh, if you have any more questions about the setup, if I did not mention something or you would might be interested in a little bit of my planner style or system or anything, um, just let me know in the comments below. And I hope you enjoyed this video. It was short, but um, there's not much to it yet. And I will definitely make a flip through of it once I'm finished with July and the challenge and then I'll show you how I used it and I hope you enjoyed it and have a great day and I'll see you soon. Bye!